The last time Peter Jackson hung with a bunch of dwarves and this guy... Precious. He grabbed 17 Oscars, cashed in a $180 million paycheck, and bought himself a golf stream. I quite like the idea of stepping back into Middle Earth and, you know, telling a new story. You must be Mr. Boggins. Yeah, no wonder he's back, this time spending six years and a half billion dollars to bring a new trilogy to the big screen, starting with The Hobbit and Unexpected Journey. It's unlike anything I've ever seen before. There's far too many dwarves in my dining room as it is. Martin Freeman as Hobbit Bilbo Baggins, Ian McKellen back as Gandalf the Grey. This Gandalf is more of a fun yes. Gandalf. The whole of The Hobbit is more fun than Lord of the Rings. Lord of the Rings is about saving the world. The hero doesn't make it back home. The Hobbit gets back home because he's just been on an adventure. That's the difference. The big difference this time, Jackson revolutionizing the way the film was shot. First major movie shot in 48 frames a second. Peter, we need a techno translation, please. It's like you chop a hole in the back of the cinema and take the screen away and you look into the real world. And Kate Middleton just announced her pregnancy. She and her husband had asked could they come and we found them a couple of seats. Yes. And then she gets pregnant. I mean, can't they organize their personal diary better than this? The Hobbit, as real as a fantasy world can get, in theaters December 14th. Thank you for watching Extra on YouTube. And for 24-7 updates on celebrity news, subscribe to our channel here like us on Facebook here, or follow us on Twitter here. And if you want your voice heard, leave a comment below. Where? Right there. <laughs>